I suppose you laughed a lot at that last part of the video. It just it was tiny bit on how to switch it off very fast, but I almost got wet. I was so fancy trying to like uh, look natural and not like I I'm sitting here where I'm trying to like you're not filming me. Trying to ignore the camera and look very natural and then the wave just got in the way. <laughs> it got my almost almost wet, almost wet, but there were a lot of fun moments while we were filming there and we film another thing also which is coming up probably next week or something. So it was like I got wet literally there. <laughs> My t-shirt, my my, my 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 blouse, my shorts, uh, waves were, were just getting me. <laughs> so yeah, guys, uh, I want to make like kind of a uh, very short story. So hi, <laughs> I want to make very uh, short story about this uh, backpack. So what I do not like about it, what I like about it, what should I start from? What I don't like about it. Okay, because. No, what I like about all right, what I like about it. <laughs> sorry, what I like about it uh, is that uh, I like the fabric. It is the fabric, the same fabric which I used for my uh, jumpsuit from my dungarees. I used also a small piece of this fabric to make Alejandro's shorts, and yes, I was still left with a little bit. And before, when we were moving and when we were packing and everything, I literally made it in one day. I had small pieces of some fabrics and I was just trying to reorganize everything to see what I'm taking with me, what I'm throwing away and those just small pieces, uh, I looked at them and I, I decided okay let me just cut them uh, cut them and try to make this uh, this backpack which the pattern, I bought this pattern I think pretty, I don't know, maybe like, like a little long before I decided to finally make it so um, what I added, which wasn't in the pattern, is um, I added uh, that I added uh, interfacing, interfacing with a type of which is kind of good. As, as you can see here on the back, it's, it's a little bit like you see. Uh, it is not the denim. The denim. This denim is thin, like this part for example this part doesn't have this interfacing as and you can see it's a little bit formless and uh, I had just a little bit of that interfacing so it was enough for all this part and I had a tiny tiny piece for maybe this part of the front only like until yes yeah, probably until the yes until the small pocket goes like this it doesn't go like smiling because I chose so it's just I had that piece cut like like that way and this is how I used it it was kind of thick interfacing I got from bobbing girl bobbing girl I believe yeah if something I will just leave all the information in the uh, in the post for this video and uh, did I use it for here and I also used the same interfacing for these sides so this part is pretty structured like so I can almost stand it it can almost stand it doesn't stand yes it can stand so uh, I also put this feet which are not any which are not in the instructions and I put I'll try to put the photo here what I put on, on this uh, on the down part of the backpack it's kind of it's a plastic with holes so I put this I connected with that plastic with holes and only then I put lining something like that it sounds complicated but it was easy it was just I don't know feeling natural to do so I also used another fancy interfacing for the lining but here's the thing um, I didn't have I didn't have white threads when I was doing that. I wasn't in a condition to go and buy one and I, Alejandro wasn't in condition for me to send him to the shop to buy white threads. So this thing looks weird. Where you see the pocket, 
is this blue stitching is like uh, not so nice but when I was doing that I was just didn't care I didn't want to throw away and I needed a backpack for moving so yeah guys uh, this is the I also had the zipper I had this thing this thing if you make some bags don't put this thing on the pocket where you want if you want the pocket to work like to save things here this thing opens up just like without thinking so what I stole there is lipstick even if I lose lipstick now I will be sad if I lose lipstick but I stole lipstick there the only thing which goes there is uh, mirror and lipstick that's it so uh, in the inside you can see the big pocket as you've seen in the video and three small pockets which have kind of elastic so they will not misshape they will not lose the shape or they will not yeah something like that yeah sometimes you put keys so i will not be like searching and uh yeah like this i pretty much like how it is designed inside and i like that this pocket goes this way and not to the back so sometimes you put uh, something here and it touches your back and it's not nice yes this is about what I like yes I started yes okay so um, I think I started with what I don't like and then I jumped jump to what I like okay ah, the other thing that uh, this fabric was a little different from this one and this one even it is like kind of even more tiny more like flimsy uh, and I think if I will do that again, I will not put this white thing on the on the side. Uh, not only because they're flimsy and these pockets are not even used anyhow. I don't use them at all. They're just non-functional. I don't know. I'll put a pen there, but no. They're not functional for me at all, and I will not put them there. And another reason is because they're white. They're not really really white like white, but they are light and this is like to take in the train or like uh, to travel or to go to the beach this was the purpose of this backpack and this white thing on the beach like in two days two or three days it looks already like I've had really really dirty hands touching my back it's a little gross so I need to wash it pretty often it's a good thing, I can wash it in washing machine. Nothing happened, I already washed and it's just fine. I didn't even steam it before. I wanted to steam this part as it is like... But I didn't. Uh, another thing, what I will do differently next time. I will definitely take that interfacing and I will put it all over the back. I mean, not only back and a little bit on front. I would put it everywhere, even on these sides, like, because I can imagine how this bag will look if it will be without interfacing and from the same denim material, or use really, really thick material so it won't be, it won't be sad on this side, like, uh, yeah, so another thing that I want, I would change, if I would still no. yes another thing that i will change is that i will not make this i will not make only one shoulder i will put two shoulders uh because as you could see in the video it is not comfortable for taking it off at all it is not comfortable uh it's like if you have something on your head like a hat it will go away you need to take a hat and then to take off if um uh, if you have your hair done, it will mess up your hair. If uh, if you have boobs, very pronounced boobs, it will look weird here. It's seen on the video. It doesn't look very attractive. And the another side, of course, you can like kind of make it longer, right? And it will be like easier to take off. But no, if you make this thing longer, this thing, as you can see, it is kind of very close to this bone and this is a metal and if the this part will be just slightly longer the this one shoulder thing 
will be slightly longer than this metal thing will be like kind of scratching you on this bone it is not it will be this bone <laughs> yes but it is the same thing it is kind of the bone here because i had this with the longer strap and then i needed to reduce because it is so 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 uncomfortable it's even like kind of it gives you pain and a lot of uncomfortability yeah i do not recommend that at all if you want to maintain one strap make this part slightly longer this the like the on the top make it longer and and not or and this part this metal part push it here make it make it down there so it will not touch your kind of bones or your skin it will not damage anyhow yeah i would su suggest changing it down there i also don't see why this thing has this kind of shape doesn't care really uh the good thing is um, what else what else no i would probably make it with two straps I, if, if i ever make another backpack for myself and i probably will i'm not sure but i probably will it's very comfortable to go with backpack to the to the beach i would make it with two straps one strap does not work for me it does work because i like this but i will not make it again with one strap and another thing that i had uh white a little bit of white cotton from it yeah it was from merchant mills which i bought like last summer it was also like a small piece which was left from the things which i was sewing and i used that white cotton uh to line the back i was like thinking okay i like the lining to be light so i can see everything and it's not dark and it's kind of transmit good thing and then uh the white lining for the backpack for the beach is not good each time I open and I touch with my hands, it's like from the sand, I don't know, something like that. It gets dirty so, so, so fast. Like, you blink your eyes and it get, get dirty <laughs> really, really fast. Uh, the funny thing uh, also, that pocket, had, uh, that pocket has puppies there. And I made all the kind of uh, measurements and everything, just I marked it very nicely so when I open it, the puppies will be like looking at me. But when I saw it, it looks like I disconcentrated somehow. When I saw it, uh, I opened it and puppies were upside down. I was like, oh no, but I had no time and I also had no wish to do that because we were just packing crazily, crazily, crazily. Oh, crazily, crazily everything. And yeah, I took it with me and uh, in the in the train. I had all the kind of to read the books, to kind of like detail some kind of details. I had all this in this backpack. I'm very happy I made it, and I wear it a lot to the beach these days. Um, would I recommend this pattern? The pattern, yes, I would recommend with the modifications which I suggest because of, you know, change this down there and by interfacing if you're using fabric even if it is slightly thick, use interfacing to make it stiff and it will not look very sad and yeah thank you so much to take your time to watch this video and thank you so much for your comments and support I really, I really appreciate it a lot you give me force to keep on going, keep on going, yes, keep going on, keep going on, keep, keep, should I say keep on going on, or keep on going, you understand me, keep on moving, keep on doing something, <laughs> okay, thank you guys so much for watching, and talk to you soon, bye.